The Marine Lab was just hands down the best experience that I've had at Duke, like hands down. Easily the best decision I've ever made. It's a great opportunity to really get to know your professors. Um, and I know a lot of people, at least right now, are like freaking out about getting things like letters of references, like letters of recommendations for grad school or internships. And they're like, oh, I'm in all these huge classes. How am I supposed to get to know my professors? And you go to the Marine Lab, it, you do know your professors. You, know, you have classes, five people and a professor. Um, you eat lunch with your professors. You know, the professors go by their first name. They're like your colleagues. In the spring semester, you know, I saw that you could travel to St. John. You could go to Baja, um, California in Mexico. Um, you could go over to the Philippines. You could go to Puerto Rico. Um, you could do all these things in one semester. I was like, oh, that, that's really cool. Being able to work really intimately with faculty and with PhD students, with postdocs is um, probably one of the best things about the Marine Lab. I think the Nick School also does a really good job of getting you involved in um, programs that aren't per se like in the Nick School, but are affiliated or are related to them. Um, so I know I've done um, things like Duke Engage, um, where I, I went to Duke Engage with like a adjunct uh, Nick School faculty with Matthew Godfrey, who's like the sea turtle guy in North Carolina. Um, and you know, we went over to Turkey for two months with a bunch of biology and environmental science majors, essentially. And we did sea turtle conservation work, which was really cool to do. Um, so we did the night patrols, and we would see like turtles beaching um, at night. And basically, we would find their nests um, and cage them. Um, and you could have like a very immediate impact because you noticed um, if you didn't cage the nest or if like. Um, you're coming back and there was a turtle that laid while you were on the other side of the beach, a lot of times these nests would be predated, very heavily predated, like already by foxes. Um, so you could see that you had like a very, very immediate and real impact on um, conservation.